Voice of the Meadows ready to call the Classic Series Final. Here they come for the final of the Classic Series! Up and pacing, past out of the gate is Oive. Up on the outside, strong plan. The end of the turn, racing down along the rail. Falcon Scooter is third. Mystical Matty gets away fourth. Stablemate Select Pavement down along the rail. Fifth, Misfit Six. Racing seventh, final cheers. The trailer Pacific Fella down the backside, going to the first quarter mark. Oive, the leader. Hop on the outside, Falcon Scooter to the front at opening quarter in 28 and 3, and we got Falcon Scooter on the front end. Oive second, Strong Plan racing third, Mystical Matty comes to the outside for Mike Lachance from fourth, and followed by the stablemate, Slick Paper on the outside fifth. Misfit goes to the outside six. Final cheers, racing seven, trailing the field, Pacific Fella. They race to the half mile marker in 58 and one. He into the lane. First time coming to the 5 8 mark. Mystical Matty has now taken the lead for Mike Lushans. Falcon Scooter second. Slick pavement on the outside. Misfit moves up fourth. Oive locked in fifth. Final cheer, sixth on the outside. Strong plan and Pacific Fella going to the halfway point. Mystical Matty. At the three-quarter marker, 126 and four. At third quarter in 28 and three. And down the back side she goes. Mystical Matty on top of the field by a length and three quarters. Falcon Scooter racing second. Slick pavement to the wood third. Misfit now first over on the outside fourth. Racing fifth, final cheers on the outside. Oive down along the rail six. They've got a quarter of a mile to go. Around the final turn, Mystical Matty has the lead and opens up by two and a half. Here comes final cheers. Three wide on the outside. Misfit between horses and down the stretch they come. Final cheers closing on the outside. Mystical Matty the inside. Final cheers on the outside. Pacific Fella. Final cheers. Pacific Fella and Mystical Matty. Two. 24 and 1! Options of final cheers. Winning driver John Campbell, winning trainer Brett Pelling, a great uh, combination here. John, uh, this horse was, uh, well, I'll ask Brett that uh, about the fact that he was in a claimer earlier this summer, but uh, this horse uh, sat from uh, sat back from uh, some slow fractions here. What were you thinking down the back stretch? Oh, I just wanted to save him for a good run finishing. Uh, he's a horse that tries extremely hard, and I, and I thought he fit with these horses. I'd raced him twice against this kind of competition, and had him in a bad spot both times, and uh, I, I thought he had a chance if the race broke the way it, it did. That mare really, uh, it looked like she was getting her way. Yeah, it, but the extra distance is really tough to, to keep going when you're on the lead like that. And uh, my horse is better off cover, and uh, I was following a good one in Misfit, so it worked out well. Okay, as they turn for home here, Mystical Matty on the lead. And uh, what are you thinking here, Brett? Uh, this horse uh, uh, really came on strong in the stretch. Yeah, Betty looked like she's in real good shape, but the speed hasn't been holding up that good here tonight, and the extra distance, and, you know, plus she's racing against the boys, and, and they just don't stop. They just keep coming, and, and that's what happened. And but he was great. This horse was in a claim earlier this year, right? Yeah, well, it was just one of those situations where we just snuck him in there, didn't really have anywhere else to race that week, and got away with it. Okay, think he can go on to be a top open pacer? Well, that was the plan, really, to nurse him through this year and, and bring him back as a five-year-old and, you know, a real mature horse, and I think he'll do a real good job in the Midlands. Okay, well, you had a great driver in the sulky. Final cheers, winning connections here.